With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, a air bubble of radius 1 cm in water have a upward acceleration of 9.8 cm per second square. Density of water is 1 gram per cm cube and water offer negligible drag force on the bubble. You have to find out the mass of the bubble. So if you see, let's suppose this is the water and inside the water there is a bubble and uh, it is said that it have a upward acceleration of this much so if i draw this upward acceleration and it 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 is also acted by the buoyant force in upward direction and the mg will act on this in downward direction very simple so if i write here mg will act in downward direction and buoyant force will be acting in upward direction and it is having an acceleration a in upward direction it is given in the question so now you can see net force in the upward direction is buoyant force minus mg and it is equals to mass times acceleration very simple now you can just find out the buoyant force on the bubble so if you see here the bubble is completely submerged so the volume submerged will be equals to the volume of the bubble and it is given that the radius of the bubble is one centimeter right so if i write the density of the water density of the liquid into volume submerged that is wholly submerged into g so density of the water is if you see here is one gram per centimeter cube and the volume of the bubble is four by three pi r cube so r here is 1 centimeter so r cube into g so if you will calculate this you will get 4 pi by 3 g as the buoyant force so just put this here 4 pi by 3 g minus mg is equals to mass times of acceleration now it if you see here acceleration is already given in the question it is this right so yeah so it is now you can put the value of mg in, in this equation. So if I write here, I will write here that uh, 4 pi by 3 into g is 980 centimeter per second square is equals to mg plus 9.8 times m. Now g is 980 again. So 980 plus 9.8 if you add the two you will get the yeah you can see the gravity is uh, gravitational acceleration in this so you can add the two and divide the, the the addition from this expression on the left so i will write the mass is equals to 4 pi by 3 into 980 in division so if you will add the two you will get 98 9.8 so after dividing you will get the mass is equals to 4.15 gram right so you can see 4.15 gram is the c option so c will be the correct answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today